yeah, yeah. Taking a quick moment to just kind of look around here and see, make sure everything's kind of set up. Double check the, uh, yep, that's it, that's it, okay. Hi everybody, I'm Zach Rex. And welcome to the sixth um, video Madport rant. Yo, we're back on the $40 couch. And it's still just as comfy as ever. The folks in the other room are watching something. Oh, they're watching a league of their own. Apparently, there really is no crying in baseball. And there's no crying in getting your creative work out there either. I've got to admit, I came to a stark realization today. Well, a few stark, eh, stark realizations. I don't want to be melodramatic about this. Here's where I'm at right now. Let's talk statistics. Madpoet Files started up in January and started out as basically a, well, a prod, really. It's a cattle prod. It, it's something to get me writing because apparently I need to be on a schedule, I need to be on a deadline, and self imposing that doesn't work out very well for me. If you give me a NaNoWriMo, boom, I'm there and 50,000 words and I'll bang that out and that'll be no problem. If I've got a a weekly podcast or a bi-weekly podcast, then by and large I, I can put stuff out and I can write stories and I will and I know I'm late. It's not the point. But it might become the point by the end of this pod, no, by the end of this uh, rant, so be aware. Yeah, my phone is telling me it's time to go to bed. It is time to go to bed, but not just yet. Because first I gotta figure this crap out. All right. So, first thing that, <laughs> so Mad Poet Files started up in January, and if I look at the stats for Mad Poet Files, and I'm pulling them up right now, in January I had one, two, three, four files go up. Um, High Moon went up, the first story about Frosty's Deposit went up, and No More Kings went up. And there was a PDF version of Frosty's Deposit that went up, so there were four files, I had a total of 127 downloads for the month. In February, we had those four files, and we added in the PDF version of No More Kings, uh, the assignment, and story number four, which was the first part of the Premonition uh, Cost of Miracles two-parter. For the month of February, there were seven files up now, and I had about 256 downloads. And then in March, 251. We added two more files, and that was the second part of uh, Premonition, Cost of Miracles, and number six, um, the story about the Banneker microbes. Right, 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 right. Blood Red Sand. That's right, Blood Red Sand. And so I'm looking at the stats, and I just kind of pulled them up today and, you know filtered out everything that wasn't Mad Poet Files just to try to get a sense of what's really going on out there. And what's going on is I've got about, mm, I get about 70 to 80 downloads an episode. It's not too bad. It's been 60 for the last two. So it looks like I'm getting fewer downloads over time. And... Well, that's that's enough right there, isn't it? If you're getting fewer downloads over time, that's that's an interesting thing. You go to the Facebook page, I've got 80 some odd fans on the Facebook page, but if I've got 80 some odd fans on the Facebook page and the last episode that I dropped on the 27th of March only got only has 60 downloads to date, you know, it's not that bad, is it? Because that down, because that dropped on March 27th, and to get 60 downloads by the end of the month isn't that bad. I'm concerned about the stats. Maybe I'm a little overly concerned about the stats, but the fact of the matter is, you kind of need to be. I feel like I need to be because this is something that I'm putting out there and it needs to have a purpose. What's the purpose? 
That's a good question. And I don't really think that I had a good answer for that when I started up the podcast. I don't know that I have a great answer for that now. But when I started the podcast, what it was is, like I said, it's a cattle prod. Something to get me writing. Because I need to be writing. But I don't know that it's going to fulfill a role outside of that. Now, I've put the stories up. and They're available for... Well, I am making the stories available as ebook downloads for two bucks a piece. And for everyone who's done that, thank you. Really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Please don't be mad at me when I explain what's going to happen with those stories now. Because I'm putting them together and I'm sticking them up on, uh, on Amazon as a Kindle download. And it'll be everything that's gone up. It'll be High Moon, Frosty's Deposit, whatever the second story was, all the rest of those stories. Basically, anything that I've released as an audio download on Mad Poet Files to date will be up on Kindle as soon as I can get everything kind of put together and put it up there. And I don't know how great of an idea it is, but here's what here's what I'm doing. With the Kindle download, you'll get the actual story, so there will be a short story, and then you'll get that story again in kind of an author's commentary mode. Yeah, it's an idea. I'm just playing with it. And basically it's, it's the short story, it's the same short story, but with kind of my commentary thrown in and saying, you know, pay attention to this, here's something I did here. I don't know if it works very well, because like I said, this is podcast, this is practice, folks. But look at this that I did here, look at that I did there, this is why I did that, this is where my head was, this is what I was thinking. So you get an idea of kind of where my head, you know, what the process is. I don't know if you're necessarily interested in that. I think I would be interested in that, but then again, who knows. Now, that explains what happens with everything that's happened on the website up to date. The question now is, what happens going forward? Because I come to the realization that if I'm actually going to try to get any of these things published, if I put them out on the podcast first, well, I've basically shot myself in the foot for anybody who wants to buy first publication rights because they won't have first publication. It'll be published on the website first, and that's that's not going to make an editor happy. I, I have to admit, I, when I sat down and I really thought about it, I realized that if I was an editor and I was taking a look at short stories that were coming in, I would be more hesitant to buy something that was available for free someplace out there on the web simply because it's available for free someplace out there on the web. Why would I pick some why would I grab something somebody could get for free and stick it in my four pay magazine? Now granted people do that all the time, but I'm just trying to think if I was an editor, if it was my magazine, what would I be doing? which means I have to come up with a plan for how I'm going to handle short stories in the future. Now, I'm not putting Mad Poet Files away. I'm not killing the podcast. But I think I'm going to need a couple weeks to think this... Th no, 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 no. I shouldn't say that. I'm going to need a little time to think this through. It's not going to take a couple weeks. It'll probably just take a couple days. But it means that anything that I put up on Mad Poet Files, I've got to realize I won't be able to sell someplace else. So that means I've just got to write faster, I've got to write more, I've got to write better. Because if I'm going to sell anything, I'm going to have to write that in addition to anything I'm doing for Mad Poet Files. You may not see you may not see short stories every two weeks there anymore. Not that that'll be a surprise. Oh my gosh, Zach's slipping on a schedule. Wow, there's a shocker. But. Uh, Still trying to figure this out, folks. We're learning as we go. And what else can you do? Anyway, to everybody out there who's listening, to everybody out there who's watching, appreciate you. Thank you very much. Please stay tuned to the feed, and as soon as that Kindle download is available, I will post a note. Take it easy.